Hi, today I'm going to talk about how to add Chinese input on Mac and how to switch the language source. So first click this Apple sign, uh, System Preferences, so Language and Region. Uh, this is the preferred languages, but actually we're going to click here, Keyboard Preferences. And now we can see if on the input source there is only American English. We're going to add and choose Chinese. So there's simplified Chinese is used in mainland China, and traditional Chinese is used in Taiwan, Hong Kong, or some other region. I click on Chinese simplified, and here is different ways to type this simplified Chinese. And we're going to select PIN simplified. So PIN is uh is the uh this is the Chinese pronunciation system used in mainland China. And uh, it's a way to type based on the sound of the Chinese character. So we choose this one. We click Add. And now we is headed here. We can see now uh, on the here. You can see this is the American English. And if we want to switch Chinese, one way is just click there, and we choose Chinese. And let's say Pin. Pin is the pronunciation system, and you can see actually this character. P is short for P, which is the pronunciation system. And when we are in P, interestingly, uh, we are typing Chinese, but if we click on caps lock, it comes back to English. So see now I already clicked caps lock and it's I'm typing English, but here it still shows P. In. That is actually a shortcut to switch between Latin and non-Latin language. That is when in the scenario we thought, oh, I'm actually in pain, why I can only type English. Uh, that is weird. That is, you just need to maybe accidentally click on uh, caps lock. Now I click back, I can type Chinese. And then I want to introduce a, another way, a shortcut, that you can switch between these two languages. Uh, we do need to actually check the system preferences. Uh, there is a shortcut and uh, shortcut for input sources. So now it is actually this 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 uh, command space is chosen, but we can see this is a shortcut also used by another action. And if I don't use this, actually, I'm just gonna disable this. And I only use this shortcut for input source to select the previous input source. Since I just have two input sources, I don't mind just uh, to only go to the previous one. So now I'm using command space. Okay, it is switching between Pinyin and American English. All right, thanks for watching. Hope the best with your Chinese learning.